You've been waiting for it. I've been waiting for it. I cannot believe this is the sixth year in a row I've done Vlogmas. Cue the music. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 1, aka another day of the marathon. Life's not a sprint, it's a marathon, and we are doing this Vlogmas style which really means nothing because I daily vlog, but I don't care. It's fun, it's like a YouTube community thing that was started by Ingrid Nilsson a thousand years ago, and I love it. I, like I said, this is year six of me doing Vlogmas, and there is a playlist on my channel of all first five years, if you would like to go back and watch them. Some of them are pretty cringy, but I am thrilled that I did it because it's so cute to see Thomas like growing in the last five years. And of course, I have five years of Vlogmas memories on film for Thomas and for me with Jeremy. So it's, uh, it's a blessing for sure. But today, I am starting up Vlogmas in a festive shirt. Look at... All the Santas dancing with the snowflakes. This is an early Christmas gift for my wife, Jess, and it is the softest shirt I've ever had on my body. I was like, tell me all about this. It's called Lula Row, Lulu Row, Lula Row or something. I never even heard of it. But she sent this to me early and I'm thrilled because now I can just pet myself and I needed a festive shirt for Vlogmas. This morning I was really bummed. I cannot find my Christmas sweaters. They're not in any of the tubs I thought they'd be in. I thought maybe they were in like spare room, or sorry, my office, bedroom, storage room. No, I got a cute reindeer one, I got a penguin one. So Thomas has some cute Christmas sweaters ready to wear, but. I'm gonna have to see if I can find some super cheap ones because I need yeah. some festive garb for Vlogmas and just, yeah. you know, as I'm trying to really be in the Christmas spirit and work on it this year, you know, you know. Anyways, me and this one are celebrating also that it's Friday. Oh, I'm so happy it's Friday. It's time for shoes and then school. Would you like to say hello? Hello, hello, hello. Good morning. Let's go get our shoes on, please. <laughs> you can bring your snacks. Okay, I need to put the camera down because we're feeling a little bit um, slow this morning, I can tell. Hi. Oh. <laughs> experience PMS just for one day just one oh my goodness she is PMSing today that's the moral of that story but I've got I think about 10 orders beside me so I'm gonna go to the post office but first I am heading to have lunch with my friend Deb who I haven't seen in forever so happy it's Friday and I was definitely feeling it this morning, so I texted one of the women who does respite for me and was like, do you have like a couple hours tomorrow afternoon? I just need a break. She was like, yeah, no problem. So, amazing. Because I definitely don't, I'm not good at booking respite just to like actually use it for what it's supposed to be, which is like rejuvenation getting yourself like relaxed and calm and energized. No, I usually just use it because I have events or work and I've definitely been told that that's not what it's for. <laughs> so tomorrow when she comes and takes him, I'm hoping they'll go do something like fun and festive or something. And then I just want to do stuff around my house. like check on my Christmas shopping that I need to get done and like the laundry that I still haven't folded that I washed on Sunday and today is Friday. Stuff like that really bugs me. And just like tidy, I have all these piles that I need to go through and like a package that I haven't opened in forever and just stuff like that that I just need to do. 
but you know, it's just like, it's not a priority. And then the next day it's not a priority. And so that's what I'm hoping to do tomorrow, which might not sound like relaxation to you, but to me, it really will be just to help me like putter around the house. I love that. Like, you know me, my home and my space really affects my mood and my mental health a lot. Like, I'm definitely one of those people who can't have a dirty house, can't have a messy house. Like, and when I do, it stresses me out. So, I'm really looking forward to puttering tomorrow as probably, I know some of you can relate to this. Some of you are probably like, I don't care. But also, like, I bought a brand new TV last weekend and I've watched it once. So, it's just stuff like that, you know, that I just want time. I was actually thinking to myself, I wish there was another day of the week in which we could just like get everything done, tick all of our boxes, you know? So anyway, these are all first world problems, but that's what I'm looking forward to this weekend. <laughs> How about you? <laughs> lunch with Deb and then I just went and mailed a ton of merch and got all the bubble wrap I had to get red slash pink some boxes some bubble wrap envelopes trying to figure out the best way to mail Christmas presents and then I have this like tatty ass list of Christmas gifts I need to buy still and I thought, because I have time, not enough time to go home and like edit tonight's video, but enough time to maybe do some Christmas shopping. Um, but I'll go do that while I don't have Thomas. I just got my brother, my sister-in-law, and their kids done, checked, because I have to, they live in the States, so I need to mail theirs soon. And I realized I need to get on my mom's because she's in the States. Okay, I just had to censor myself because I just told you about what I got my brother for Christmas. Why? How often are we just like, by the light of my laptop, talking in my office? Hashtag entrepreneur, boss babe, work from home, own my own business, blah, blah, you know. <laughs> it's 4.33 to be precise, and I totally failed you this afternoon because... After I picked up Thomas from school, we went to Toys for Tots to Teens. It was magical. He went up and hugged Santa, fist bumped Santa, stroked his arm, was really like interactive with Santa. Did I take a photo? No. Did I film it? No. I just stood there in the moment, my heart swelling and enjoyed it. Is that a fail? Kind of when you're a vlogger, but also, oh, my heart grew just like the Grinch. It was adorable. We took armloads of presents. Those stockings that you saw in yesterday's video, those were taken to Toys for Tots to Teens this morning. Then this afternoon we took teddy bear, we took a teddy bear, like four books. I took some like really nice um, lotion and body wash and soaps for the teens and some Elmo toys, like all kinds of stuff. Did I film any of that? No. We were just in the moment. Also, I was much more concerned with the fact that I had to take photos for two clients while I was there and I had to call the radio station to do a live cut in to encourage people to come down. So, my apologies. Trust me, it was adorable. I loved it. You would have loved it. It was great. Here we are sitting back in my office again. <laughs> Please forgive me. I'm having a bit of a rough PMSE day. Now I'm editing the second vlog of the day because I wanted to, normally my vlogs are two days out, but I wanted to make them one day out because that's what we do at Vlogmas. But stay tuned because I have something super exciting to tell you. We're doing something different this year for, for Vlogmas and uh, we're going to start it in this video. So any guesses? Any guesses? Maybe it says in the title. I don't know. I don't know. But that's where we're at. I have a little bit more work to do, and then definitely gonna take advantage of my new TV tonight. I'm gonna do my nails, cause we can't be having this. 
and just like enjoy a Friday night, a chill Friday night. Thomas is tired, I'm tired, and we're just gonna have a nice, lovely evening in this evening. My tree just looks majestic. Let's let her be the focus for a second. Like, what? Dang. Dang. What? Okay. I have to tell you something. The most incredible thing just happened. And there's a couple times where I was like, oh, I should grab my camera. But it was just like, again, like the Santa moment today. Okay, Thomas and I just played for 40 minutes with no protesting. Like, I'm speechless. This is amazing. All we were playing with was a slinky and then we were just like tickling and wrestling and he was getting me to squish him and he was getting me to like put my feet on his chest and like pound it and like it was uh, we read it's, it's a vlogmas miracle like it was just such connection and such bonding and so amazing okay I'm gonna end Vlogmas Day 1 with an exciting announcement for the first time ever uh, in my six years of doing Vlogmas. I am going to be doing 12 days of giveaways in Vlogmas. What? So every other day there's going to be a giveaway at the end of the video and we're starting out with something that's very near and dear to my heart. These giveaways are going to be things that you hear me talk about all the time so it's kind of like Oprah's favorite things but Mayor's favorite things. I thought it would be fun. Nothing crazy extravagant, just things I love and I want to share the love with you because you've been so amazing to me this year that I thought it would be really fun to do. So um, yeah, that's just going to be stuff that I love and we're starting out with probably no surprise. You Are a Badass by Jen Sincero. I have, at any given time, multiple copies of this book in my house because I like to give it away so often. This book changed my life. No exaggeration. So all you have to do to enter the giveaway is be a subscriber of this channel. Give this video a like and comment below telling me why this would be important to you in 2018. This book is called You Are a Badass, How to Stop Doubting Your Greatness and Start Living an Awesome Life. It seriously changed my world and I listen to this book multiple times a year. It's, it's amazing. If you read this and you really take to heart what she says, this could, 2018 could be endless possibilities for you like I feel like it is for me. So that is the announcement. We're doing 12 days of giveaways for Vlogmas 2017, my sixth year of doing Vlogmas. Every other day there will be a giveaway and every day there'll probably be <sighs> crazy hair. Well that for sure. There'll be different ways to enter. So this is the first giveaway. I hope you're as excited as I am. This book is amazing and I can't wait to send it to one of you. So thanks for watching. Please lace up and become a marathon or subscribe to my channel. Make sure you are a subscriber. If you want to enter any of the 12 days of giveaways, tell your friends, join the community, join the Facebook group. My heart is very full um, after a very emotional pms -E day. <laughs> uh, not the no most normal start to Vlogmas, but that's what my Vlogmas is going to be. It's not going to be your typical Vlogmas, but... Um, I hope that you'll hang out and you'll stick around and I'm really excited about it. Vlogmas has such a special place in my heart. So thanks for watching and cue the music. I will see you tomorrow. Bye.